cases in Latin are the nominative, which is the subject case, the genitive, which is the case of possession, the dative, which is the case of the indirect object, and we'll be saying more about that in a few minutes, the accusative, which is the case of the direct object, the ablative, which is the case of separation, and the vocative, which is the case of address. Now, these cases are best learnt within a paradigm, so we're going to use the word rosa, which is rose, or the flower rose. So its forms are in the nominative rosa, which means simply rose, or a rose, or the rose, rosei, which is of a rose, rosei, two or four a rose, rosam, rose as the direct object, rosa, by, with, or from a rose, and rosa, a rose. There are also the plurals, rosei, roses, rosarum, of roses, rosis, two or four roses, rosas, uh, roses as direct object, rosis, by, with, or from roses, rosei, o roses. Now, these uh, nouns that end in a and follow this, this uh, pattern are called the first declension, and here are its is its full uh, paradigm, which you should learn in detail. Uh, note that we're going to drop the vocative because it's the same as the nominative, and we'll memorize these five forms. Nominative, rosa, rosi, rosi, rosam, rosa, and plural, rosi, rosarum, rosis, rosas, rosis.